Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. So in the last video, I did a um, wreck -a ring with Unicorn Spit. And I asked if you guys wanted to see a flip cup, and you said yes. So that's what we're going to do today. I'm using the same cup here and the same Unicorn Spit that I actually mixed up a few days ago. I actually mixed this on Wednesday and today's Saturday. I did add a few more drops of water into it. Um, but we're going to go ahead and just give this a go with a flip cup. I think this will use up the rest of my pre-mixed unicorn spit here. And this is an 8x10 canvas, so I only need about 5 ounces of paint. And the colors I used were um, a metallic purple, a metallic gold, and then a turquoise and blue thunder <laughs> so if you're unfamiliar with what unicorn spit is it is a gel stain so it's not an acrylic paint you can get it actually at um, a lot of like the stores like home depot and lowe's and stuff like that i'm sure there are some art and craft stores you can get them at i do not believe they have at Ma them at michael's but I'm pretty sure they do have them at Hobby Lobby. You might be able to get them at Walmart, I'm not sure. So anyways, you can definitely get them on Amazon. They are really fun. And you can um, you can obviously paint with them, you can use them with resin, you can um, actually like refinish furniture, like stain furniture with them and everything. So pretty cool deal. This is a Loli Vefe um, silicone bowl. And I have a few of them. And this is a Loli Vefe silicone mat. They're really great because I just reuse and reuse and reuse. So it saves me a lot of materials. A lot. All, the de all of the materials will be down in the description. So please check that out if you have any questions on where to get something or what I it was that I used. I'll make sure that's all in the description. Okay. So there's no silicone or anything in here. All of these are mixed with Floetrol with just a tiny, tiny bit of water. So, I put all that yellow and blue on the bottom because I wanted to get some really cool green, but so far it looks like the blue is kind of taking over. Let's see what happens. Hopefully that kind of changes. If not, this may end up just being a really cool background. <laughs> Okay, so you can see that the uh, turquoise is kind of under there as I'm stretching it out. It's kind of coming out a little bit more, but definitely not as exciting as I was hoping for. Hmm. I'm going to run it back this way a bit. This is like a really cool underwater scene, but yeah, really not as exciting as I was hoping for. I do love the tree rings with this, but for flip cup, I'm not so sure. I have been requested to do a swipe with it and also to do a vase. So those will be coming up in the next couple weeks or so. But as it sits here, it looks like some more color is coming through. So let's let it sit for a little while, and then we will come in and we will do our close-up. All right, so we're back. Um, little cells that kind of popped up. I think there was, you know, air bubbles in there. But really not that exciting. I mean, it's pretty. And it kind of actually makes me think of like a starry night scene. So I might add something over here because this side's pretty cool actually, but this side's pretty bare. So maybe something coming up over here. I'm not sure what exactly, we'll see. But for now, it'll just be a background. <laughs> All right, let's do our close up. Okay, lower right hand corner. Lots of blue here coming up to the upper right hand corner. Now, ironically, the color that I put the most of in this painting was purple. Upper left-hand corner. And then 
lower left hand corner you can see a little bit of the purple there and if you look at kind of the angle you can see the sparkliness so this is actually pretty sparkly painting all right so there you have it a flip cup with unicorn spit um i do have some more videos that will be coming up like i'll be trying it on a vase and i do have some other colors not a lot but i have um a metallic red also and then a non-metallic purple so i do have two more of those and who knows maybe i can pick up some more in the next few days or so if we're allowed out of our houses <laughs> um anyways i hope you enjoyed this and i will see you all next time